everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I finally received my Kylie Cosmetics order and it was the buy one get one free lip kit thing. So, I've got four lip kits, a lip gloss and a highlighter to show you. And I'm super excited to um, try them all. So I don't know, because some of them are quite dark, so I think I'm gonna do the nudie ones first. Um, so yeah, let's jump on into it. So the first shade I'm using is Posy K, um, which you'll obviously one of the older ones that she has done. Um, I'm not gonna use the lip liner, because obviously these come with a liner and a lipstick. Um, I'm just gonna go in and whack this color out, um, because obviously I'm gonna be taking it off, um, and just see kind of how pink it is and what it's like. This is Posy K, which actually, I'm not gonna lie, I thought it was gonna be a lot more pink and it's actually quite dark. Um, still really nice, but yeah, I thought it was gonna be more pink, like lighter. Um, it's actually quite dark. Uh, so yes, I'm gonna see what it's like next to high maintenance. I'm gonna draw it on my hand now. Um, I've already done some swatches earlier with different products, but I'm gonna put them on my hand and show what the difference is between Posy K and high maintenance. Okay. So high maintenance is the color that I thought Posy K was gonna be. As you can see, that's Posy K, which actually doesn't look that pink. That's a better shot. So this one, this is the colour I thought Posy K was going to be. So I'm quite excited to try high maintenance. Do a new setup as because normally when I'm filming, I have to get um, all my makeup stuff out and then I lean it on the makeup stands and um, all that jazz. So I thought we'll do a different setup today. You know, we'll do a different setup today. It'll be different. And uh, this is going to be so much hard work trying to get these off. So far, so good. Well, that took me probably about a year to get off. So I'm going to go in with high maintenance. Now, this is the one that I thought I didn't think it was. I thought it'd be lighter than uh, like the same kind of shade as Posy K. That's why I wanted to buy it. But actually, I think this one is probably going to be my favourite because Coco K is my favourite. That's what I need to do next. See well, what this is like next to. Um, next to Coco K. This is my kind of color. Yeah, like I love this shade. This shade's really nice. But I'm gonna get the Coco K color. Right, so I've got, this is high maintenance on my lips. And this is Coco K. Oh, okay. So, this is Coco K and that's high maintenance. So as you can see, Coco K is quite a lot more, almost nudie, beigey, and that is more, a lot more pink. Um, interesting. Right, so that's them two done. I'm gonna have to take this off again now. Oh. And then we're gonna go into these two dark colors, Leo and Love Bite. I'm really excited to try Love Bite because that color looks ten off. Okay, well that one was easier to get off. Let's just add that first. So I'm gonna go in with the color Love Bite because I think, let me, I'm gonna put this on my arm, my arm as well. Um, Leo, well let me just check, yeah I'll put them down there. Okay, so this is, oh actually they look quite different but um, let me just swatch them. So, whoa, that can't be Love Bite surely. Oh. Okay, Love Bite is a lot more brown than I thought it would be. Oh, Leo is going to be amazing. Right, so this is the shade Leo. And this is the shade Love Bite. So I thought Love Bite was going to be a lot more purpley, but it's kind of more brown. Um, ignore this. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, so this is the shade... <coughs> choking on air. This is the shade Love Bite. I think. Yeah. Already, this is actually really nice to apply. I think this is a different formula. It feels different. This one is really pretty though. It's 
it's quite like grungy but I like it yeah that one's weird that one was a lot more lighter a lot more um almost more liquidy uh and it doesn't dry as fast the other one really was drying as soon as I put it on so like when I was trying to get it off there was no hope so maybe they, they changed the formula which I preferred this how this one went off went on they might not have but um you know so this is the color love bite I'm now going to wear the color leo leo i thought i was going to prefer this color to leo but putting it on my hand i definitely think i'm going to prefer leo um so i'm going to take that off apply leo and then we can go on to the highlight okay so already that lips come off i think either it's because it's darker and the slightly newer product so they put something else in it but this comes off so much easier. Hasn't it? Look, and it's not even really around my face. That first one was awful. Okay, so this is the shade Leo. I'm excited to try this one. I love I love red. Um, and this is kind of like a burgundy. So let's go in and apply Leo. Again, this is like the newer formula. I swear that they've changed it. Okay, so this one is very, uh, a lot more light, but if you, if I zoom in, can you see that? As soon as you do that, it like changes and it's gone quite patchy. So the formula is good in the fact it's light and it doesn't smell as much. Uh, this is mad other ones normally I apply it and I go like that whereas this one when you do that it goes really patchy which is a kind of a shame because it's such a lovely colour although it looks so dark in um, the camera it's dark but I just thought it was going to be more red it looks quite dark Oh my god, look. I've put my lips together. Look at that. Why has it done that? I do, especially with Coco K, I use it all the time. I apply it, put my lips together, so it like transfers on the top and then carry on. Although, this one comes off easy again. Maybe that's why they're like the formula that they've done. That looks weird. <laughs> uh, the new formula or something like is more liquidy, so it comes off. Yeah, that's strange. Right, so let me just sort out my lips because I look like the guy from um, most Monsters Inc. where he gets his things stuck in that machine. That's literally what I look like. Okay, so I've sorted my face out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the highlight now before I do my lips again because I want to do Cupid's bow and all that jazz. Um, so this is the colour. Oh, no, I can't open it. This is the colour French Vanilla. So it comes in this packaging. It comes with a little mirror. And this is the colour. So I think this was the lightest one that they do very pigmented which is obviously really good um so let's just apply a few little bit of bits really okay so, oh up up okay so it is very very good so i'm gonna go in with a fan brush just see how pigmented it is on brushes Okay, okay, we're good. Wow. Oh my god. I think I've gone a bit overboard. Okay, so the highlighter is definitely popping for sure. 
So, I mean, the lipstick was a bit of a disappointment because I thought Leo was going to be my favourite shade. Maybe it's just because I've been using different a product on my lip to get rid of my um to get rid of the lipstick before. But all in all, these products I absolutely love them. This is why I bought them. And luckily, it was buy one get one free, so technically, like I could have got the Leo one for free. Um, I absolutely love the shade of them. I was I'm just kind of disappointed, I guess, with that Leo shade. Like I really thought I was gonna love it, and I do love the color. But it was just looking awful. And normally, because I use Coco K, it's my favourite shade, I use it all the time. Um, for that to smudge when... Um, no, I use that all the time. And when I put, like, put it on, I always go like that and then go over the top. Um, and for some reason, that was just splitting, which I guess is a little bit disappointing in a way. Um, but anyway, so these are the four shades that I used and the highlighter. Um, I'll leave her, link, her website below. So that you go to like the genuine place um because i know there's a few fakes out there so yes i hope you enjoyed this i quickly wanted to say that if you turn that notification bell on when you click subscribe um it notifies you when i do a new video so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up give me any suggestions if there's any other product you want me to try or like try it on and go through and give you my honest opinion um then let me know um so yeah, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, comment below, and don't forget to subscribe if you're new.